Bad. Mr. Morgan. You know, the last time I came out here to the Evers Ranch, I thought Nick was a lucky man. For every beast of the forest is mine, and the cattle upon a thousand hills. You've preached at a lot of funerals around here lately. You got something new for this one? The funeral's for the living, Mr. Morgan. I'll say what his folks want to hear, that Nick Evers was a good son, a good brother, a loyal friend, and a respected citizen. You think he won't gag on all that? Why should I? I'm a gambler, Mr. Rudd, and I don't always bank on my cards. If I did, I'd wind up broke. Like the people you play with. Well, it don't happen too often, but every once in a while, something comes out of the air, lands on your shoulder and says something in your ear. An hour ago, it landed. And what did it say to you, Mr. Boyd? It said, this is it. Play it. Well, then, play it. You're the killer, Mr. Rudd, of Nick Evers and all the rest. Make that execution of the criminals who killed my brother. They hanged him for no more than some fast work with a playing card. That's all my brother was worth. Six of diamonds, four of spades. What was George worth? He wasn't even in the game. Nick Evers swore to me that George was on the end of that rope, and so were you. George wasn't there, and neither was I. So Nick was the one who talked. But well, looking back, he was due to go bad all the way. I thought he was too smart to get himself killed. Nobody's too smart for that, Mr. Morgan, not even you. And not even you, Mr. Rudd. You left George for dead. But he lived long enough to say something with his hands. It didn't come to me until you turned that last chair over to card table. Then it all jumped together. George wasn't praying. He wasn't begging. He was just trying to show who killed him. A man that prayed. A preaching man. Now, we'll take Nick over to his people, but uh, you won't be reading over him, because I'm taking you in. There'll be no trouble, Mr. Morgan. But, uh, if you don't mind, first I'd like to, uh, read the rest of that song. About the, uh, Thousand Hills. i read. Well, can't you read upside down? If that's a Bible, you read it. If it's not, you drop it. Was the man we've been looking for, Mr. Evers. The killer. Of Nick, too? But why? Well, I don't know about the others, but uh, I think Nick got on to him, like I did. <laughs> 